Hello everybody, my name is Keaton, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Banjo-Tooie. In the last episode, we ha we continued our trek through Grunty Industries, and we opened a few of the battery doors. In this episode, we're going to be he going into the packaging room. And, uh, ooh, I see three colors. Twinkly, Twinkly Packaging Challenge has been located. Game rules are available if required. Nah, I'm fine. So, like all the other mini games, there the different colors are worth the different points. And in this mini game, you just have to run into all the Twinklies. And then, running into them isn't enough. You actually do have to go up here and uh, deposit them manually. I don't quite remember what the number is I have to beat. So, no, 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 no. So, I'm just gonna be uh, getting all of the twinklies before I hand them in at the end. Before the time runs up. In fact, I'm gonna do that right now. Three, 18, 11. Backing requirements have been met. A bonus will now be awarded. Hooray! Do you want to play again? No. Because most of these mini games only have one. Oh, it's gone. Most of these mini games only have one reward. And that would be a jiggy. So. I actually don't remember. Have I? Yeah, I have been on that. Okay. So. You. Oh, by the way. That Jinjo up there, you were supposed to, you notice how there's a hole there? That hole is because you were supposed to break open a, um, a hole on the side of one of the smokestacks and you fell down and got that. That's how you were supposed to get it. I used a clockwork to get it because I didn't want to have to, because uh, there's no flight pad in there, I don't think. So you would have to uh, go all the way back up to the roof. Um... Big O pants. Old rubbish. I want to. Just one more time. Yeah, okay, you got it. Alright. So let's go back to the. I still haven't found Mumbo's. Um. Mumbo's Globo. Has to be in this. I think I know where it is. I bet you. I think it's up here. And mm, perhaps that's not what I want to do. Perhaps I was a bit quick with my decision. Yeah, that's just eggs. But if I go this way, no? Hmm. Or did I already get Mumbo's Globo and I already, okay, you know what? Wait, I can find out. I think? Two out of two, I already got Mumbo's Globo from this world. So the fact that I have five means I'm not missing one because the overworld only has one. Never mind. I thought I was missing one because I had an odd number. But there is indeed an odd number. Because to get uh, Dragon Kazooie, uh, you needed a Mega Globo, which is a counter all on its own. So we do have enough for Mumbo. We do have his. So I'm going to give it to him. Welcome again, Baron Bird. 
We've got a Mumbo. Must give magic creature to Mumbo if want help. Want Mumbo's help? Yeah, sure, why not? Sure, we need all the help we can get. Throw it in Mumbo's bag. Whee! Um. No. I don't want Mumbo's help. I'll be right back. And by be right back, I mean, well, you'll see. Alright. So, real quick. I want to give, uh, I want to give the Globo to Humba Wumba, or whatever her name is. And now, I will meet you guys back at Mumbo's. Alright, so, our first order of Mumbo business is in here. Well, kind of. This is in here. Our first order of Mumbo business is in here. So, again, kind of. You don't do the boogla boogla. Here is our first order of business. Oh, it's big. Hope this works. EMP electromagnets. Magnet malfunction. Auto fixing program initiated. Magnet will be reactivated in 90 seconds. So we need to hurry. What are we trying to hurry again? What are we, well, we're hurrying against the magnet. But let's just say there is a reason why I gave uh, Wamba that Globo beforehand. Because I didn't want that cutscene to get in the way. I don't know if the timer would continue while that cutscene was playing. I don't actually think it would, but regard regardless, we need to hurry. Now, why would we need to shut off the electromagnet to push a button that was too heavy for Banjo and Kazooie? Well, I'll show you. Showing finale. Showing complete! Humba call this washer. Use control stick to move and press Z to fire plenty underwear. Yep. The uh, transformation for this stage is a washing machine. Which suddenly makes sense why giving power to, uh, to things would also turn on the electromagnet, thus pulling you off of the magnet button, or the button for the power. And uh, as for the secondary ability, as for the um, secondary ability of being uh, a washing machine, I'll show you that in a second. Power! Where is this going? Why, up here, of course. Yeah, let's ignore that uh, giant magnet for now. But we're actually uh, complete with um, complete with that. Also, in case you were curious, underwear. Yes, it can actually damage things. <laughs> oh. One more thing I want to do uh, before we conclude our washing machine adventures. And that... Actually, there's two things I want to do. First things first, I want to I wanna go back to 
the first floor. Entry and exit. That is a claw climber boots. First order of business is that. Can I even? Yes. Yes, I can. I'm pretty sure this, or even this, is what you're supposed to use. It's actually, I don't think that gives you any. Uh, yeah, it gives you a, a little bit of extra height. Alright, is there a ladder over here? There is. How? Oh, you. Okay, you need to die. What? Die. You didn't even give me any health. How rude. <laughs> now, you. <laughs> like that. Whoop. All right. Oh. And. Eat battery. Uh oh. Uh oh. Don't. Okay. Not the. Don't literally eat battery. That would probably end in death. But, take a battery upside the head. That's a bit better. <laughs> All right, so, over here is where we need to go. Hi. Because, battery. Additional battery power. Channel to door. Access now granted. Yay. I think that might be the uh, last battery around. So, where are we going this time? The waste disposal plant. My favorite. If I could only get up this ladder. Okay, thank you. Away! Well, hello. And goodbye. Oh, hello. That's not something I wanted. That's not something I wanted at all. Alright. There are notes here. This might look a bit familiar. Toxic waste oil water. The Hailfire Peaks oil pipeline. And the Jolly Rogers Lagoon. Well, it's probably just Rogers Lagoon pipeline. Water pipeline. Nope, you're a, you're a toxic one. Jolly Rogers Lagoon water pipeline. Now, there is a reason why I... Did you just... You did? Okay, so yeah, definitely take those things out the second you see them. And actually, I think I've made a mistake. I don't... I'm pretty sure this was a Banjo-only move. I'll stop that. Only suffocate me as long as I'm not jumping. Dead. Alright, let's... Maybe it's a Kazooie only one. Nah. I'm pretty sure it's a Banjo only one. Forget it, punk. You won't be needing that flea bag with you to learn this one. Why are you cheeky? Oh, there's a ladder. <laughs> Oops. Wee! Ow. That's the ground. Hello! Snooze pack! 
when you're feeling rather low, I know a place that you can go. Z followed C right. Remove your pack. Have a nap to get your energy back. I'll be all. Is missed. By the way, um, there is a an HD version, I guess, or a remake on the Xbox Live Arcade. They released, I think they released both Banjo Kazooie and Banjo Tooie. By the way, we can't do anything about that over there. So, uh, sorry about that. Not yet, anyway. We can come back later with a move. I just wanted that uh, move from in here. But, um, you might be wondering what happened to the rhymes that Jam Jars makes using the buttons, you know, like B and C and all that. Uh, well, unfortunately, they didn't make new rhymes to go along with the new control schemes. So it's just, it's, it's a bit disappointing. But what can you do? All right, so let's head back out here. There's one more thing I want to do in Grunty Industries before we stop, before we stop doing this for now and go to another area because we can't get everything in here anyway. And that is unlock the last area of the elevator, which just so happens to be on the other side of the crusher. Do you want Mumbo's help again? Yes, I do want Mumbo's help again. So, what don't you say we go ecum bocum EMP up a giant crushing machine? Shall we? Nah. Alright. Hope this works. EMP wall crushers. It also makes the um, belt crusher malfunction. Initialize an auto fixing program. Crusher will be reactivated in 45 seconds. We have no time to lose. Unfortunately, the way to turn off the crushers is on the other side. So we need to run through it to turn it off. Yeah. Later, Bumbo. Look, we're already we're already lost over half our time. Actually, this is near the crusher. I hope I have enough time left. <laughs> I don't like. Wall crushers have now been switched off. Huh. Ah, and that there makes me think that it was indeed not a one-hit kill, but it probably took over half your health. Oh, hey, look, there's a camera. Um, excuse me. I don't want any. Thank you. This way, there should be a door. Cable room. Neat. That's where, that's where the last, I think the last battery goes? I don't actually know if there's any more batteries. Nah. And that was the last thing I wanted to do, is open the last bit of the elevator. Because now, we can go to all of the areas from the main room. Well, we, we, from the elevator. 
sewer access. So let's let's see. How how good are we on um, stuff? Two. But other than that, we're only missing one Jinjo, and I know how to get it. We can get that. Now. But... I think this right here is probably the last thing we're going to do. Since we're in the area, we might as well do this as well. Welcome to the sewers. Attention! The clinkers have invaded the sewer system and are blocking the vents. Neutralize them all before the air becomes toxic. Yeah. So welcome to another uh, to another uh, multiplayer stage. Uh. Yep. And yes, it is indeed making fart noises. So, let's... There also is no collectibles in here. Are you just literally waiting there so that way I can't pass? Like that. Let's continue on the... I saw you. Nah. Nah. Like that. Um... I don't want to mix up and... Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll go back down. Didn't quite do that on purpose, but... I don't want to do half of the bottom and then start on the top. Ah, wait, I got him. I got him. Neat. I need more blue eggs. Almost full, too. Cool. Uh, I think actually that's good. Nah. Oh. Here. I hear something in this room. Nope, it's something in this room over here. No. Uh, alright. Perhaps we have to go around more. Uh, by the way, in this, you can use um, the, sea st the sea stick to strafe. If that is something you wish to do. There's some there's one down here. Dead. Uh, there's that way, but there's also this way. Ha. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. Like that. Clockwork. I need to hurry. I don't think I'm going to. Okay, no. All right. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna just head back to the uh, entrance if I can find it. Because um, this. I think this is the entrance right here. Yeah, here we go. You could continue on and beat the mission, but I wasn't feeling, um... Yeah. Sensors still indicate clinker presence. Cleanup bonus will be withheld until they have been neutralized. Let's head back in and try it one more time, shall we?
Well, well, we'll try it. Let's go back in and continue trying it until we beat it. This was one we missed. That's where it was. That was, that was the one that we missed. Well, we missed four. There's one in here. Some in here. There's one in here. That... Hear you. No. Mm, no. There we go. Oh no, this is the other direction. Cool. All right, we have ten left. One of them, one of which is up here. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Um, been down there. No, I fell. I wasn't, I didn't want to fall. Uh, in here and in this direction. Oh, wait. Three. I've come too close to, to stop now. Dead. Four, third, two, four. What? Why aren't I? Why aren't I using fire eggs? I have an infinite supply of those. I have one left. Where? Did I check back here. I check back here. Yeah. I think I have to go up here. Ha! Why? Send a syndicate clicker threats have been neutralized. A cleanup bonus will be awarded. <sighs> Jiggy! Alright, now we have to find our way out of here. You are definitely to just block the way. Two hours later. Was was that Shadow of Tipos? I, one one second. I, I that 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 Shadow of Tipos. That Shadow is very much a Tipo. All right, so we got a Jiggy. Hooray! Also, hooray for tea houses. <laughs> All right, let's let's get out of here then, shall we? Uh. Ah. Uh, uh oh. Uh oh. Come on! So let's head over to the elevator then. We will leave this place because we're done for now. What on here? I do have one more glitch to show you. And that is if you do this, you can T-pose yourself an infinite of distance. 
I guess it's not really a T pose, it's it's the falling pose. You know what I mean. You can fall an infinite distance without worrying about fall damage. And we can take the front door. Don't have a lot of jiggies. But the ones we do have are pretty great. We got three? Three. We got three from this area. And the only uh, collectible other than jiggies that we're missing? Actually, do we eat all the notes? We got all the notes too. Yeah, so the only collectibles we're missing is one Cheeto page and one Jinjo. The Jinjo, we know where it is. The Cheeto page, I'm pretty sure I know where the, the Cheeto page is. It was, I think the Cheeto page is back behind that giant fan. Uh, and uh, we cannot get a good majority. We could still get a few more uh, uh, jiggies from that area. But seeing as how we're, we have to go back there anyway, might as well just save it for later. Um, so yeah, I guess that's it then. In this episode, we uh, opened up every floor of the elevator, uh, got a interesting jiggy um so in the next episode we'll actually be starting hellfire peaks but until then my name has been keaton and hopefully i'll see you in the next episode bye bye